Ugh, that toxic voice sounds familiar. Haven't I heard it before in Arum Alley? You know what? This isn't my first time dealing with the Skyfaring Commission. I can handle your unreasonable ways. But straight up snatching IPC cargo? Isn't that going a bit too far? Just as I've said it many times already. Once we've inspected the cargo and completed the security check, you can be on your way. Is there something wrong with your ears, or is it just your brain? I'm hearing you loud and clear. I'm thinking clear. And my answer is crystal clear. Not a chance. Keep detaining my cargo, and I'll file a complaint directly with your general. You jerk. Who are you calling a dog? Wait. Why are you here? You're staying on the Sienjo, are you? What terrible luck. Wherever you go, disasters aren't far behind. Aren't you the guest from the Astral Express? What brings you and Yanqing to the Artisanship Commission? Trouble caused by the IPC? I'd say it's caused by the Skyfaring Commission! Looks like you've met this IPC worker before. <laughs> I'm not sure if that's a good or a bad thing. I was sent here to deal with the IPC protest, Mishikwe. What's going on here? <sighs> As you know, this IPC transport ship was attacked by the Borison and rescued by the Juming's diplomatic ship. Then the Cloud Knights were instructed to bring it back to the dock for repairs and inspections. And this is Mr. Scott, the person in charge of this transport ship. So, you're Scott. I've heard him mention you. Weren't you kicked off the Lafu before? Why did you come back? Like I wanted to come back. I thought I'd just dock at the harbor for repairs and leave this forsaken place for good. Little did I know, as soon as the ship entered the harbor, a bunch of Cloud Knights showed up and snatched all our cargo from the hold. What do you mean by snatched? I've told you a million times. It's a security check. Then why did you bring the cargo to the Artisanship Commission? You even brought in some shady craftsmen. It's obvious you're trying to steal the IPC's patented technology! Listen here. Firstly, the Skyfaring Commission detected dangerous items that could possibly be weapons in your cargo hold. That's why they called me here, to double check. Secondly, where the heck did you get the idea that I'm a shady craftsman? Even if there are dangerous items, what do they have to do with you? It's not even being shipped to the law, foo. We'll just fix the ship and be on our way. We won't unload our cargo here. But you'll have to stay in the port for several days before your ship is repaired and you can take off again. How can we just leave unchecked items sitting here? I understand, but we don't need to disassemble the cargo if it's just a security check, right? In most cases, we don't. However, our scans discovered that the cargo doesn't only contain machinery, but also some substance that resembles biological tissue. Biological tissue? Does this crate contain living things? I'm afraid we'll need to wait for the Alchemy Commission for further confirmation. In any case, according to our regulations, we need to unseal one of the crates for further examination. But this IPC specialist has been hindering us on the grounds of patent secrecy. The Alliance's regulations on biological products are very strict. Without further inspection, there is no way for the Skyfaring Commission to release the cargo. Oh, really? Fine! If anyone lays a finger on that shipment, they'll have me to deal with. It doesn't matter if it's mechanical or biological. It's none of your business. I'm filing a complaint against the Skyfaring Commission's ridiculous regulations. <sighs> this Mr. Scott seems stubborn and difficult to persuade. Honestly, I really don't want to have a vicious confrontation with the IPC. I heard how you helped Aram Ali. The IPC representative back then was Mr. Scott, right? Since you've dealt with him before, it looks like I'll have to rely on you again. What are you guys whispering about over there? Just hurry up and give us back our cargo. 